Hey there, in this video we're going to be covering by far the most important part of our sales process and that is the wedge or the discovery framework. Most people know that the key to being a successful sales organisation is understanding your prospects needs and goals and being able to relate your product or service back to the prospect as a way, ideally the only way, for them to achieve them. And that's where the wedge comes in. It's at the very heart of the sales process and if you don't use it already, implementing even a basic discovery phase in your sales process will significantly increase your close rates. The wedge does exactly what it says on the tin. We use it to open up the conversation with the customer so we can explore bigger business priorities and company goals. At the beginning of the call, we focus on where the customer is and the status of where they're at before opening up the conversation to where they want to get to, including business priorities far wider than just the area of business that our product or service sits into. Here's the three main reasons why discovery calls are so essential. Reason one, telling ain't selling. I've lost count of how many times I've watched sales calls and they start with people presenting the same slides with the same social proof and the same features that they use for every other customer they speak to. Ask yourself this, if you are going to pitch your products or service, would you rather deliver it straight out of the box or would you rather have the information from the client that would allow you to tailor your pitch and presentation so that you have it the opportunity to increase the perceived value of your product? I thought so. Taking your clients through the wedge discovery means you learn about your prospects' business needs, their pain points, and their goals. By asking the right questions and really listening to the answers, you can identify a gap between where they are now and where they want to get to. We need this information more than ever, as it's unlikely you're gonna get face time with all the stakeholders involved in the decision-making process, so if your presentation or pitch deck lands on the desk of someone who isn't familiar with your product or service, they have to be able to pick it up and within 30 seconds or so, understand exactly how your product or service is gonna help that organization. As an example, we don't position our product or service as a way to get more sales meetings. We position ourselves as a way to grow top line revenue for the whole company. Top line revenue growth is a goal and aspiration that will resonate with anyone in an organization. If we were to say we just book you more meetings, for instance, it only really resonates with the sales department. Reason two, build rapport and establish trust. The Wedge Discovery Framework not only helps you tailor your pitch, but it also gives you the opportunity to build rapport and establish yourself as a trusted advisor. Just by asking intelligent questions and getting the prospect to speak about their business needs, you build credibility in the value of your service without even saying anything. Why? Because by asking questions in a specific way, you position yourself as an authority. In the same way that a surgeon meeting with you and asking very specific questions relating to an operation builds trust and credibility with them. Let me just repeat that. Before you've demonstrated what your product or service can do, you're already increasing the value and perceived likelihood of success just by asking questions. And the third and final reason that discovery is so important is that it gives you the opportunity to preempt the most common objections. Well-conducted discovery calls are a great way to preempt objections that may scupper your sales process later on. Asking questions head on about common objections or alternatives to your products gives you the opportunity to disqualify prospects that aren't a good fit or have low intent and keep control of the conversation with those that are. It sounds silly initially, but by addressing objections early on, you can ensure that the conversation stays focused on the benefits and value of your product or service rather than getting sidetracked by objections or concerns later on in the sales process. So there you have it. There's three reasons why we view the wedge as the most important part of the sales process. If you want to see exactly how you can implement an effective discovery framework in your business, get in touch with us this week and we'll organize a free 12 month growth plan, which will enable you to double outbound revenue in as little as 12 months. Thanks for watching.